She's not so enthusiastic about coming back to this side of the barn now, but there's horses on the other side. She thought maybe that'd be a better deal over there, but I ain't gonna let her have a chance to do that. I want her to stop out here, and then I'm gonna take her in through another part of the barn to go back to where we need to be. All right, but I'll tell you what, I wrote my books specifically for horses like this and owners that have them. And in my opinion, if in my opinion, if you got to do that much work just to get this horse down the road safely and back without her losing her mind, why the hell would you want to do that? There's plenty of damn good horses out there that you don't have to fight with, that you can be safe on. And probably at one time she was too, but if you don't do your job and keep up with the training and don't get these horses formed with a lot of bad habits, you can ruin any horse. And she's a good example of that too. Every time you get on your horse, you're teaching them to do something. And if you let them get to this point, then shame on you. Y'all have a good one.